So let's continue with this separation process. We need to model these flash drums. Recall that flash drums are essentially separation processes in which we separate the liquid phase and the vapor phase according to their equilibrium. Now we have this stream inlet which contains 15% ethane, 20% propane, 60% isobutane, 5% n-butane. Let's assume this is molar flow rate. The temperature is 32 Fahrenheit, the pressure is 50 psi absolute, and the flow rate is 100 pounds per hour. We will be modeling this with the fluid package of Peng Robinson. And the overall idea is to model this separation process and to find the vapor and liquids flow rate and their compositions. So let's go and model that. Open the case, add the species, which is a Ethane, propane, isopropane, and tank. Okay, we have the first species. Now let's choose the model, which is Pen Robinson, and the property environment is set up. Now let's go to simulation environment, choose the separator, which we will be modeling. Double click. Let's call this the flash drum. Enter. Let be the feed stream or the inlet stream called flat and the feed vapor. Let vapor and the liquid. Let it be the liquid. Okay. No need to state any kind of uh, energy since this is is thermal or adiabatic. We don't need to add or remove any kind of heat. Let's go. Parameters, we don't need to add any kind of dropping pressure because the vapor will simply go up. There's not that much dropping pressure because the vapor goes naturally up and the liquid remains down. So no need to state that. Maybe if you are modeling a more specific case and you know you have here a manometer and it has a loss, well, add it. Right now we, we will not add anything right there. Now we have the model. We need to modify the inlet. The inlet was 3 to Fahrenheit, yes, PSI, 50 PSI, and the mass flow was 100 pounds per hour. Yes. Properties no need to change. This is small fraction, which is exactly what we want to change. So ethane will be 15%, propane was 20%, isobutane was 60%. And finally, 5% for n -butane. As you can see, it's okay, which implies this is fixed, and the flash drum has already run all the simulation. So we need to check out the material streams here. Right here. So let's analyze this. The inlet or the feed is initially 23% vapor and eventually the vapor goes all here so that's why 1% or sorry one fraction or 100% and the liquid will be zero right here it has zero vapor of course it's liquid now temperature remains the same because it's isothermal non change in it's simply vapor and liquid separates it's a flash separation Pressure remains, there's no pressure drop. If you have any pressure drop, you will see it right here. The mass flow remains initially 100 and finally 100. So vapor plus liquid should give you 100. The vapor is approx 19.80 pounds and the liquid is 80.20 pounds. So that's interesting that it does not necessarily needs to be the vapor right here. So you cannot assume that the equilibrium is simply 23 uh, pounds are going in the vapor and 77 will be in the liquid because there is interaction between the species. And, well, no need to. This heat flow is actually not a heat flow, it implies the energy of the stream. Now, we also want to verify the composition, so let's go here, workbook, worksheet, sorry and let's go to the composition so initially we had this actually it's blue because we can still change it the liquid composition of ethane is very low of course the ethane is very volatile so you should go to vapor 
and the butane is a little bit heavier so it should increase in the liquid okay so expect these two guys to increase and these two guys to decrease right here propane should remain very near to the middle because it's the let's say the middle this is a light one heavy one and this is middle so it should remain near 20 percent and it actually does 19 percent 25 percent okay so this is why i wanted to show you the flash separation 